Is it time to buy or sell Alibaba stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Alibaba. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, June 20, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since June 20, 2023, our system has ranked Alibaba as a sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 1.25. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. We'll continue monitoring this evaluation to see how it unfolds in the coming days. The stock lies in the middle of a wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current 3-month trend suggests a potential minus 11.10% change over the next 3 months, with a possible return between minus 23.12% and minus 5.90%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 6.09% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 37.86% and 25.55%. This translates to a price range of $54.64 to $110.40 after a year. Our latest daily update for Alibaba includes the headline, Alibaba stock downgraded to sell candidate. The Alibaba stock price fell by minus 4.53% on the last day, Tuesday, June 20, 2023, from $92.10 to $87.93. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 3.22% from a day low at $87.32 to a day high of $90.13. The price has risen in 5 of the last 10 days and is up by 4.18% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 2 million shares and in total, 23 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.04 billion. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $125.84, and the lowest price was $58.01. Currently, the price is 30.13%, or $37.91, below the 52-week high, and 72.46%, or $231.39, below the all-time high on October 27, 2020, when the price reached $319.32. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Barclays set a price target of 141. On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Barclays set a price target of 141. On Wednesday, January 11, 2023, Barclays set a price target of 141. On Tuesday, January 10, 2023, Citigroup set a price target of 160. On Tuesday, January 10, 2023, Citigroup set a price target of 160. Analysts have given Alibaba stock a general buy rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for Alibaba. The Alibaba stock holds a sell signal from the short-term moving average, at the same time, However, there is a buy signal from the long-term average. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average there is a general buy signal in the stock giving a positive forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the short-term moving average at approximately $88.37. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the long-term average at approximately $84.82. A breakup through the short-term average will send a buy signal, whereas a breakdown through the long-term average will send a sell signal. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the 3-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. 
Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Thursday, June 15, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 4.63%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 3 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 2 days ago. Short term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. Long term moving average, by signal 11 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 8 days ago. If we look at the 12 month chart we see. Short moving average, by signal 13 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 2 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 67 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Alibaba Alibaba finds support from accumulated volume at $87.89 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $2.81 between high and low, or 3.22%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 2.18%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Alibaba, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. This extremely high P-E ratio suggests that the stock could be overvalued. However, it's not uncommon for tech companies or those with huge market potential to have such high ratios. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2023 is expected on August 03, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.97. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Alibaba. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Alibaba is at $98.40. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Alibaba encounters its first support level at $87.89. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Alibaba stock a good buy? Alibaba holds several negative signals and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a hold slash accumulate to a sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Wednesday, June 21, we expect Alibaba to open up $0.530 and start trading at $88.46. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.